Hey everyone, welcome to your universe Z, the place where we talk all about the Dragon Ball universe. Today we are going to go through Gohan training with Whis to obtain superior instinct. And if you would like to see more Dragon Ball content, please leave your like and subscribe to join our universe Z. Ultra Instinct is an extremely powerful divine transformation. Angels are always in a state of Ultra Instinct, though they can activate or deactivate the ability if they so choose. While in the manga, it is said that one must have complete control of their emotions in order for the balance of Ultra Instinct not to be disturbed, in the anime, there is apparently no such risk, as Goku was able to use anger to increase his power. Power even more, but it is also possible that Goku used his anger without being consumed by his emotions. Could he, considering all of Gohan's limitations and abilities, be able to learn to use superior instinct? How could this happen? Let's try to talk a little bit about that in today's video. Gohan is the son of Goku and Chi Chi, which makes him a half-breed Saiyan. He is known to have incredible potential, however, his duties often prevent him from fulfilling it. After the Tournament of Power, Gohan began training seriously again. It is possible that in the future, the universe will face imminent destruction once again and Gohan will have to step up. For this reason, fans expect Gohan to get stronger. Just as Goku learned superior instinct from Meru's, Gohan could do something similar by learning from Wit. So far, Saiyans are the only mortals known to have achieved superior instinct. And so far, only one Saiyan has been able to achieve this, much to the surprise of the gods, Grand Zano, Beerus, and Angels, Wis, Grand Priest, who struggle to achieve the higher instinct. There is nothing that says that the nature of the higher instinct makes Saiyans the only mortals capable of achieving it. But on the other hand, there is nothing that says the technique is no different than Super Saiyan or Super Saiyan God, which are definitely powers exclusive to Saiyans. Still, superior instinct is clearly defined as less a transformation and more a state that a fighter manifests when he slash she can go beyond conscious thought and emotional distress in battle. This kind of clarity and serenity is not inherently limited to a specific race, but is simply a level of control that most mortal warriors can never achieve. So can a half saiyan achieve ultra instinct? Granted as a half saiyan, Gohan was able to reach super saiyan 1 to 2 just like Goku, but his power set gets much murkier from there. Goku made the leap to super saiyan 3 in the Majin Buu saga of Dragon Ball Z. Gohan's powers changed when his latent power was unlocked by Shin. Since that time, Gohan's power has taken on a unique signature. Pairing for Dragon Ball Super's tournament of power, Gohan further increased his latent powers to compete against the fiercest warriors in the multiverse. During a sparring session with Goku, it became clear that even without significant transformation in his physical form, Gohan's latent power is now able to withstand Goku's Super Saiyan Blue power, although a Kaioken boost gives Goku the clear advantage. Gohan doesn't have all the power to achieve superior instinct, and presumably with the right divine teacher, an angel, Gohan could probably unlock superior instinct perhaps even faster and more fully than Goku initially did. Superior Instinct is a form that requires a large training grid. Despite the form's incredible abilities, using this form correctly is difficult. This form has the disadvantage of costing a lot of stamina, making every effort very stressful, although it is noted by Wiss and Belmont that this problem can be overcome with proper training, making it impractical for users after obtaining it. Furthermore, Goku apparently attained the Enhanced Ultra Instinct purely by accident, as the next time he discussed it with Vedira, Goku replied that he is unable to use his power at will, meaning that the form can only appear if Goku is in extreme danger. One who can awaken this mental state gains the ability to react to any threat without the need to become aware of it and defend himself. In other words, its user defends himself against blows from his opponents in an automatic way, because the body reacts without the need for the fighter to have to think of some kind of defense. Way. The Angel Wiz has already made it clear that the technique is not 100% perfect and its user is still susceptible to some types of danger. To achieve superior instinct, the user needs to be empty of thoughts and abandon any kind of distraction that prevents his body from getting this natural reaction to dodge blows automatically. In the Dragon Ball Super anime, Wiss also states that it is necessary to break a kind of self-limiting shell in order for the form to be fully awakened. Still according to the angel, performing any kind of attack when using superior instinct is difficult. The reason is that practically any fighter thinks before he attacks, which slows down his execution time and can become a problem in this state. Wiss also stated that because of these issues, Vedira would not be able to awaken the technique, because of his fighting style. The Saiyan himself has already admitted that he probably won't be able to use superior instinct. Anime also made it clear that the technique can be a great danger to mortals who do not go through training with a god or one of the angels. Reason is that, just like overusing Kaioken, the user cannot use superior instinct for more than a few minutes, as it causes the user's body to go far beyond its limits. Said, considering Gohan's capabilities and his unique abilities, it is quite possible that, 
Given the right training, he could be able to learn superior instinct. Could he even be trained by Wiss himself? After all, now that Gohan wishes to become more powerful and demonstrated a new ability recently in the newest film in the franchise. Gohan's latest transformation was the Gohan Beast, also known as just Beast, is an extremely powerful transformation that is an evolved form of Gohan's unique unleashed potential state. Gohan Beast is an evolved form of Gohan's unleashed potential state, stemming from Gohan's continuous awakening since he was a child, and is currently his strongest transformation in recent media. Bo believed shortly before Gohan achieved the form that he would be the strongest, and in the promotion of the movie Torayama referred to Gohan as being stronger than anyone, but not having had a chance to shine recently. His power was such that he defeated the weakened Cell Max with ease, although it is said by Piccolo that they could never have won without Gamma 2's sacrifice bringing down Cell Max's battle power, although Piccolo might have been saying this to avoid underestimating Gamma 2's sacrifice to Dr. Hido. In Dragon Ball Super, Superhero, Gohan attained the form after witnessing the apparent death of Piccolo by Cell Max and transformed out of pure rage, just like his first transformation into Super Saiyan 2 against the original Cell. In this form, he effortlessly resisted and brutally retaliated against a full force punch from Cell Max and was able to completely annihilate his huge energy sphere as well as his core with a special beam cannon while Orange Piccolo was restricting the giant's movement. With this idea in mind, it could be possible for Gohan, encouraged by his father to become even more powerful and merge his transformations, he could learn not only superior instinct from Whis, for example, but also merge this ability with the Gohan Beast, becoming even more powerful and with a transformation even more unique to the character. It would be largely epic to see this animated, don't you think? Father and son fighting side by side with their greatest transformations to protect the earth and the people they love would certainly be something remarkable in Dragon Ball history. What about you? Do you like to see Gohan training with Whis and ultimately fighting side by side with his father with both using the same techniques? How powerful could they become? Leave your opinion about it in the comments. That's it, I really hope you enjoyed the video, if you have any suggestions for videos don't forget to comment here below, because I'll be reading all of them as I always do. Also don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed the video and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss out on any content from your universe Z.